There's a lot of great sports history associated with St. Louis's Hill neighborhood. Big names, big games in baseball and soccer. But those are sports that are pretty much played all over. Patrick Murphy's story tonight is about a ball game that has never wandered very far from this neighborhood. You want to play bocce ball? You come to the Hill. Who's the best player around here? Well, that's a complicated story. <laughs> because everybody, because everybody is going to be the best. Aldo Della Croce was one of the founders of the Italia America Bocce Club. He learned to play as a boy in Italy. I know a lot of people come over here and throw the ball, they think that's what you used to do. But the ball, when you throw the ball, that's the last thing you do. You gotta take it where you wanna do. Growing up in the neighborhood, every other corner had a tavern. And every tavern had a bocce court in the yard. Had to play outside when it was cold. But we managed, and the old timers, they took us in every once in a while. Of course, they beat the heck out of us. They had their game down pat, let me tell you. Today, the hill has kept much of its Italian flavor. And the game of bocce is still an important part of life in the neighborhood. It's a team sport, and the point of the game is to score points by positioning the balls as close as possible to another little ball called the Polino. This is a bocce ball, and I'm going to roll it down there to get the point. How'd you do? Uh, not that good. <laughs> So now, I'm going to roll another one to get another point. Now that one's a good one. Ah, that's the point. Finally, vindicated. I married into the Numerosi family about 15 years ago. And this is my oldest son, Giuseppe, my youngest son, Carlo. We're missing one. He's at work tonight. And my husband, Joe, his father is one of the original founders of the Bochi Club. Did your grandfather teach you? Yes. What was that like? Brutal. <laughs> it's harder than it looks. Word around here is that bocce goes back at least a couple of thousand years. And when you played a game that long, it becomes more than just a game. You know, people get together here that maybe not, never got together only at church. But they get together here, play cards, Bocce, just enjoy it. I live in Afton. She lives in uh, Richmond Heights. Richmond Heights. People live in South County, West County, uh, different parts of the city. the city. But this is like a you come over here and enjoy. It's like a reunion. In 1993, the club moved from a space on Manchester to its current home on Marconi Avenue. Converting an abandoned industrial space into a clubhouse called upon the wide range of their members' practical skills. In the membership of this club, there are many, many tradesmen. You know, guys, plumbers, electricians, yeah. carpenters, My, myself, myself, I make the statue. For the statue you see this. You see those statues on the front my, there? That's his a, work. He comes from a region of Italy that's called Tuscany. And, That's they're, what they're, and that is there for their uh, Michelangelo. Oh yeah, well, all of them. Leonardo da Vinci. They're all, all custom. <laughs> this is traditional. They're from from kid on, they start working with yeah, stone. Yeah, from the kid. See, start working with stone. Well, he does be does beautiful work. Yeah. Of course, now we're we got memories. <laughs> Yeah, that's it. We now we have it. memories. You can't use the hands anymore. Like I used to be. <laughs> you know. And though Bochi is rooted in tradition, some things have changed. We started playing almost when the men did. They didn't object. But of course the men got it started. But then the women joined in because they can't go anywhere without their women. You know that, right? <laughs> In the old days, the women were home, they didn't go to work, they raised the kids on the hill. Now the women went to work. They belong here just like we belong. 
Without the women, they're hurt today. And I admire them. The women play, I would say, as good as the men. And in fact, there's mixed leagues now. Men and women together. And they uh, seem to enjoy it as much as the women. And we're getting more people joining the club because of the mixed league. There's a lot of new people coming. Okay, Mom, go. Mom, go. I'm going to try Carlos technique here since I didn't do very good on the first one. The boche is a, is a, it can be a serious game. In the meantime, it can be a fun game. Anybody can play. You can play good, you can play even bad, you can enjoy it. That's what makes it so nice.